Hey guys, welcome back to Shipwrecked. So, last time, we did a little bit more base improvement and a bit of preparation for the next season. And this time, I'm kind of going to continue with that. I kind of want this beehive. Uh, only problem is, I haven't explored the rest of the world enough to find out if there's any more in my close vicinity that I can reach before hurricane season. And then... That entails the next problem of waiting for these bees is probably going to take me to freaking hurricane season at this rate. Yeah, it's uh, going to be a little while, I assume. But that doesn't bother me too much. As I guess I can just uh, do a little bit of collecting as I wait. And some of the stuff I don't actually have back at base. And to save me some time of... What the hell is going on over here? Heard some weird growling sounds. But it saved me some time of actually waiting for inventory management. Once it gets to actually taking out the beehive, I should probably eat all this stuff now. It also helps because my hunger is going down quite a bit. The thing with characters, this is just something I was thinking. The thing with characters with hunger that depletes quickly is they might have benefits that help you early game but late game that quicker depleting hunger is just going to get annoying and that's why I prefer to take a character that just has normal hunger things rather than like uh, quicker depleting hunger I mean if you look at Walani she doesn't have too many upsides other than just a good early game boost and then it just gets to late game and you've got the decreased um, well, the quicker hunger drain, which can be slightly annoying, I guess. Uh, yes, I'm just rambling to fill time <laughs> until the morning comes. Come on, uh, sanity drain. I kind of want to work on getting those green mushrooms. I don't think there's any monkeys left near them, so that's kind of like open season for me to be able to get some. I will probably clear out all the marsh. Uh, turf at some point just so it looks nicer. Uh, I don't think the poison things are too much of an issue because I can just get rid of those um, anyway. And here we go. Game on. Got myself one of those. Come on. Don't have all day. Go back to your little ha houses, little hutches. That's actually a good point. I should probably get some butterflies for my bees back at base. Uh, I just need one more of these so I can use the rest for catching butterflies. Here is one. I could have ended up killing that one with the speed it took to get around. Uh, this is a non over in this direction. It's kind of weird because you don't tend to look out for butterflies too often. They're kind of just the things that fly about, and I guess you can catch some for food. Uh, just one more. I probably check back on the bee now, to be honest. And here we go. What's with all the bee puns? Let's be straight up here. Huh? One more for the count. Whoa, that's uh, a little bit more than I wanted. Wait, are they fighting the bees? Is that going down better than I anticipated? Oh no. Right, fly into the spider nest. I don't think it's going to trigger them. No. Right, taking another one out. That's fewer for me to take out when I actually take on the little hut here. Right, come on, one at a time, please. Mm, 
don't know, there's more spawning now. This doesn't make it better, just because of the amount of damage they actually do. It's probably just going to be easier to fly around. Come on. Oh, another one ready. There's a bee attacking something over there. Uh, I can just eat these. I'm gonna have my nice little sauce at some point. Just a quick loading time there. And now those bees are just randomly attacking stuff. Okay. Alright, so I think for the food side here, all right, I need one more plank of wood. So heading back to the base is probably a good idea. Well, that was a nice little haul. Oh, stay away from me, poison thing. Uh, heading over this way. Forgot to put on the minimap again, didn't I? I guess it is kind of because this is recorded straight after I recorded the last one, as you can probably tell. Um, gold nuggets, bees. Those were my quests, and I think I have done good in one of those areas. I don't really need sand, so I should probably actually put it back. I'll hop off and uh, you will make my little bee hut. There we go, and place it... Uh, where about should I place it, actually? I don't want to put it too close to the monkeys, and I don't want it to be too close to me for the season where they all get aggressive. Here seems good. Sure, it's sort of like a path down to the beach. You get the feeling you'd pass through a, uh, a flower field on the way down to the beach. This is future prospects right here, guys. Planning for the future. Alright, get this out of the way and we can make a tree farm somewhere else at some point, but not right here. As I have other plans for this area. I think maybe just make this my bee farm. Because now I have the bee hives, I can just gather more and more uh, bees from them. I guess the only problem then comes in with the other stuff. Collecting the rest of the stuffs I need because you can't actually uh, renew those from anywhere. And by that I mean, you know what I mean. Right? <laughs> oh well, I'm on about uh, honeycomb. Because you can't actually renew that, you have to take out beehives. Which is slightly annoying. Grab the berries and I'll chuck silk in here with the stingers. Should have probably chucked in the gold as well. There we go, that's nice. Grow some more food while I wait. Yeah, it seems to be going fairly well so far. I mean, I say that and then we'll get into hurricane season and it'll be the Sealnado. Which is the thing that ended me last time. So, I'm not exactly looking forward to that. Tropical Fan. It's interesting. I could use the Tropical Fan for... Um, summer. I don't think I want to waste the gold on pimped out tools at the moment. I think I'm good with what I've got. And more farms. Yeah, more farms would be nice, but at the moment it's quite a lot of resources just to spend out on that when I don't really have a renewable way to get those. I guess I have the farms with the grass and stuff. I should probably have been grabbing all those grass tufts when I was out. 
Although I could do exploration. Actually, that's a good point. I'm going to go and head up to the X marks the spot to go and see what is over there. Because most of the time it's going to be something good. And almost definitely going to be something that helps me uh, in hurricane season. If not, and it's just a waste, then... Well, that's a downfall, isn't it? I can just go and explore around the ocean. Um, probably head back to the starting island is a wise idea. So if I'm going to be going on a long time exploration, I will take... Um, I don't actually know what I'll take. I guess I'll take sweet potatoes and these. And I'll chuck... Uh, where did that go? No, it went right here. I'll just chuck all this on the floor. Because I don't really have a place to store it at the moment, unfortunately. I'll just grab some grass before I go. Because, as I mentioned before, getting this to grow back just so I can get more is uh, much better. Maybe some twigs as well, but not as many, I wouldn't think. Just because I do have quite a few here and enough of my inventory. I just finished off this row. I know I missed one at the top, which is sort of bugging me, but I think to save uh, time in the day, I'm just going to head out now. I feel like it's getting towards the point where this is actually going to affect me water wise. Start building up the wetness level, so I hope to make it over to the island before that happens because I do not like wetness levels that is probably one of the things that I hate the most in this game to be honest right, I'll just organize some of this uh, inventory management mishaps about uh, that looks good probably stick this to the side and then put that there well, that actually gave me the boost rather than... Oh, okay, no way, no, that doesn't matter. I don't need the island, it's the one below. I was thinking it was going to be an island takeover for a second. I'm just taking that for now. Jungle three seeds. Yeah, I'm still going the right way. Just sailing through all these uh, waves quite nice, actually. Um, so, yeah, just grab this from the base. Or well, the old base, I should probably say. And then head back out. Hmm, there's a bit of wood here as well. Could have probably left some of this wood at home, just so it doesn't take up as many slots. So at the moment I have actually got quite a few taken up. He says as he proceeds to take up even more slots. Right, just eat these. I'll get some slots out of the way with. Um, the original crash zone, whereabouts is it? Too bad it doesn't show me. Ah, oh, here we go. Fairly simple. I'll grab these and probably just grab some seashells to up my sanity a little bit. Especially with what season's coming up. over here. I'll just plant these to appease the tree lord. Almighty tree lord, we bow down to you with saplings to be planted. <laughs> sure, I'll go with that. Uh, extra seaweed is not to be shunned. 
Uh, can I go directly north? I can go directly north, but I have to go a little bit to the west. Just a tad. Oh, look, an explosive barrel. I wonder what would happen if I just went up and hit that. Hmm. Uh, too bad I don't have a net anymore. I do really like bioluminescence, just because of the light it gives off. Uh, this isn't the right island, but there's no reason not to check it out if it's decent. Oh, come on. Why are you giving me more stuff that takes up more slots? Hey, look. It's a fisherman hut. Ow! Damn it. Yeah, not today. What do we say to the god of death? Uh, no. Not today, mate. I think I'll pass. Oh my god, how many merms and fisher merms do you need? Tidal pool, blurt float, more fisher merms. Are they going fishing? I mean, as the name suggests, I would assume that they're going fishing. He's going fishing. Look at the little guy. Oh, they're all singing flon, flong, flong, and glup, and schleich, and flurp, and. No, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to eat it. Thank you. What are they being attacked by right now? Glopen, flopen, schlopen. Glopen, schlopen. <laughs> Almost walked right into that one. See, this place isn't so bad. I could even make a base. Yeah. I could just remove all of the bad things and uh, actually gonna stay here for the night. Free food, who doesn't like that? And believe it or not, we crashed. Absolutely brilliant, isn't it? Um, so, <laughs> I've just got set back a little bit. I guess not too much, but... Everything that I've done has just been redone. So, unless I was paying complete attention on what I was doing, I will actually forget. And to be honest, I really wasn't paying complete attention. All that I remember is Florben, Globen, Norben, Dorbe, Dorben. Back to the. <laughs> I just noticed. <laughs> it was before I did it, before I actually got my. Uh, my little. my little things from here. So, this takes place back before I fixed up my boat, really. Before I met the Flobin Globins and the... Wait, really? Was this... This is actually sort of hard to tell when it was, to be honest. Because if I'm honest right now, heading up and maybe building a base up where... The Flob and Globins is, is maybe not the worst idea. But wasn't it not night time when I was here? Like, I swear that's a new thing. I was pretty sure it got night time when I got to the Flob and Globin land. Or the Glob. The Glob land. Um, yeah, it seems a little odd. Because I do remember sailing... Oh, it got... Uh, okay. Well, looks like something good did come out of this. Let's have a gander, shall we? Where the hell? Yeah, I'm not heading over there anytime soon, unfortunately. So I did... I got to Flob and Glob and Land, and then there was green mushrooms, so it was dusk. Okay. I was maybe just a little bit behind with the mistake I made. Um, am I not next to the island? Uh, what? I'm confused. Has it remade the island? Because, I mean, that wasn't the same island, right? Or was it at a different place? Um, no, I haven't lost Flob and Globenland. I'm just in 
a lot of trouble here because I don't actually have a way to see where the friendlies are. No, no, I'm actually I'm in trouble. I need to get back on the boat. Ready? 